Jared got me this cookbook for my birthday. It's called Thug Kitchen. It's got a lot of swear words. And I think it's pretty much vegan from what I've been looking through. Today we're going to make something from this cookbook. We're going to make a mango curry. Aw, yeah. Now, I would like to say that I am a pro cooker and this is going to be an amazing thing. But I don't cook at all. Let's do it. I think you aren't supposed to cook when you're hungry. Not that I ever cook. So I'm going to eat a burger right now. First thing I'm going to do is get some quinoa steamed here because it's a curry, so obviously you want to have it with quinoa or with rice or something. So I'm just going to put some quinoa in my steamer. I also have some naan bread. We'll just let that steam for 30 minutes and booyah! So the ingredients we need is half an onion, one and a half cups of green beans, one zucchini, one bell pepper, three cloves of garlic, one mango, one and a half tablespoons of minced ginger, one cup of vegetable broth, two tablespoons of curry paste, one and a half cups of milk, a teaspoon of coconut oil, one tablespoon of soy sauce, and last but not least, some yummy looking tofu. I'm just gonna make the tofu how I usually make it. So I slice it into cubes. This is courtesy of Charlotte. Toss her in the frying pan. I'm just gonna cut up all these vegetables. I just washed off the green beans in a sieve and it's now we're cutting them into one inch pieces. In a medium sized soup pot, we're gonna put in a teaspoon of coconut oil and we're gonna toss in all the onion and fry it up till it's golden brown. Now that the onions are all browned up, we're going to take the rest of our veggies and pop them into the pot. Let that cook until the vegetables are soft. While our vegetables are simmering, we're going to slice up our mango. I'm not gonna lie, I've never cut a mango, but it's kind of tells you how, so we're just gonna try her out, I think. Avoid the pit, slice. Oh my God, how big is the pit? What in the Moses? Really feeling all the soccer moms back in the day who slice up mango for us. Who in the heck ski? All right, I think we're getting some serious pit action. All right, one side down. That's that's Dece. Those are Dece cubes. This is sticky. This is already a huge fail. Oh, pitted. It's so pitted. I don't think I've ever failed so hard at cutting something. We're gonna add the mango later with the tofu. So for now, we are working on like all the spices and stuff. So we're gonna mince the ginger. Yeah, mince 
juice it, baby. Now that the vegetables are all softened, we're gonna add in the three cloves of garlic. So I have this garlic pusher thing where you just kind of push it in. Then we're gonna toss her in and add in the ginger. Now also the curry paste. And we'll see how that goes. Now we're gonna stir this up, let it simmer for a little while after, for like 30 seconds, and then start adding in all the other ingredients. All right, now we're gonna add one tablespoon of soy sauce. We're gonna add our one cup of vegetable broth and the one and a half cups of milk. Now we bring this to a simmer. All right, now that that is simmering, we're gonna add the mango. And add our brown tofu. Put it on a low heat. And let it sit for about five minutes. Now, while that is cooking, I'm going to put some oil in a pan and fry up some naan bread. Come back to the quinoa that's all nice and cooked up now and scoop some of it into my bowl so that's ready to go. And this bad boy's ready for eating. Woo! Really good. Not too spicy. Mmm, yeah, it's definitely kind of sweet from the mango. Oh, that's nice. See, and then you do the nan test. Toss around the nan. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, boy.